Also around America tonight, President Trump signed a multi-billion dollar aid package for the border as lawmakers who toured migrant detention facilities expressed outrage over the conditions. Border Patrol is also under fire after inappropriate posts surfaced in a Facebook group for current and former employees. We should warn you this contains a disturbing image. Nicole Killian has details now from Washington. Members of the Congressional Hispanic Caucus visited migrant detention facilities in Texas and expressed outrage. New York Congresswoman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez said women she spoke with at a facility near El Paso are being mistreated. These women were being told by CBP officers to drink out of the toilet. They were drinking water out of the toilet. Customs and Border Patrol is also investigating inappropriate posts on a Facebook group for 95 500 current and former employees. According to the media group ProPublica, one member posted this photo of a dead migrant and his daughter and asked if it was fake because the bodies were so clean. In another post, group members responded with indifference to the death of a 16-year-old Guatemalan migrant. If he dies, he dies. That shows, unfortunately, that there are many within CBP who become desensitized to the point of being dangerous to the migrants in their care. Late Monday, the president signed a $4.6 billion aid package for the border and defended CBP. The Border Patrol, they're patriots, they're great people. They love our country. They know what's coming in. President Trump suggested he will move forward with immigration raids after the July 4th holiday. Nicole Gillian, CBS News, Washington.